What's up, tribe? What's up? Welcome back to my channel, Presents of the Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today's just going to be a quick message for the tribe. So if you're resonating, awesome. Appreciate if you subscribe, like, share those you think are resonating too. Let's get into it. All right, y'all. So the title I got for this reading is Coming Out of a Trance. So you could definitely be coming out of some type of illusion, some type of um, spiritual hex, okay? Some type of spell. Somebody could have had you like in a spell, okay? So here's the downloads I got. So let's get into it. We have white cat. You could have a white cat. You could be seeing a lot of white cats. This is also spirit. Then you know that they're um, around you, that they're protecting you, they're watching over you in your home. I have curtains, okay? So um, something is being pulled back. The curtains are being pulled back on a situation. This could also be like a spell being broken, okay? I'm also getting like um, somebody got to pack up their tricks and go. Um, magician energy. This could be an Aries. You could be an Aries. Or you're not falling for anyone tricks anymore. Uh, I'm also getting like you're manifesting at a fast rate at this time. And you're having it your way. Okay. Something about your Mars placements could be very significant, y'all. Something about the color green could be significant. I was also getting ogre. This could also be heart chakra. You could be opening up your heart. Um, people could be saying somebody acts ugly or... Some, some somebody could be saying you act ugly or you're ugly or something like that because i was also getting princess fiona okay i feel like you want to meet your match with somebody that understands you that can relate to you um somebody could be very egotistical and napoleon complex this person could be very short or they have like a ego okay this person could have locks for some of you guys. I feel like uh, somebody could have red hair. Something about Napoleon Dynamite could be significant. You could live in the country or be very super country. Or somebody could say your accent is very country. Some of you guys are moving to the country. I keep getting that. Pecans could be significant. Pecan ice cream. So maybe somebody likes that. Okay. February the 16th could be significant. Your car may need oil. You could be getting verification or ID to get something. Or you may need ID to get something. Okay. But I feel like it's going to be a simple process, whatever this is. Your child could be sneaking in the fridge at night. Or you may need to leave the fridge alone at a certain time at night. Or don't eat before bed. It could be like heavy on your stomach. Maybe you like to do late night snacking. And you may have to kind of cut back on that. Somebody could have a slick bun. Or somebody has a slick mouth. Okay. That's what I'm getting. Like somebody could be saying this about you. Like, oh, they have a bad attitude. They have a slick mouth. Um, They really have an ugly attitude. Like somebody's trying to portray like... You setting boundaries is a form of being a mean girl or a mean guy, and it's not. Okay, somebody's just mad because you're setting boundaries with them. So they want everybody to see you the way they see you. Okay. Bun B could be significant. Bun B burgers, trill burgers. Okay. Somebody think they're slick. Okay, so somebody thinks that they're slick by trying to say you're slick. I don't know. Somebody's trying to uh, mess with your image. This could even be someone who's trying to say bad things about you um, online so that other people can, you know, deter from you. I feel like somebody's going to, they call themselves trying to say bad things or call your name out. And it's only bringing people towards you. That's what I'm getting here. So more people going to be guided towards you through this slick mouth person. Somebody wants a three-way, if you know what I mean, okay? You could have a couple who wants you to join them, all right? Somebody could be recording you while y'all on the phone. You could be getting collect calls from jail. You may find out that somebody's in jail, somebody, I don't know. Don't add them on your phone line, so don't add somebody on your phone line. Maybe somebody might ask you, hey, can I get on your phone? Supposed to say no. 
you could be switching your phone service or getting a new phone. 1111, you could be seeing 1111 a lot or something is divine time. Like this is your time to shine and someone don't want that. It's like somebody going to push. It's like somebody agenda to push you out of the spotlight. It's only going to push you towards the spotlight, like, or to get a lot of attention, recognition, um, a lot of sales, clientele, money. The number 38 or somebody could be 38, okay? Sushi, you could be going on a sushi date or a nice fancy date. Somebody wants to take you out on a nice fancy date. Something about cat food or cats. Somebody has a cat or you, you could be feeding a cat. Somebody could be from Florida. I'm also, somebody name could be, last name could be Evans. All right. Somebody about to be booked for a show or go to a show. That's what I'm getting. You could be a showstopper, okay? You get a lot of attention, even unwanted attention. You can walk in a room and get unwanted attention. And it's like um, people are mesmerized by you. You put people in a trance. That's what I'm getting here. Because I'm hearing I put a spell on you. So you be putting people in a spell unknowingly because you exude some type of magic, okay? You're a beautiful this could be through your looks this could be through your voice this could be you could be like the whole package like you're the whole package and i feel like this is why somebody wants to treat you right when it comes to a relationship because they know like you're everything you're god sent. like that's why somebody sees you or you could be seeing this for yourself you're like i'm god saint like you know your worth to the point where other people knows your worth like people want to do things for you this is why whenever this person talks slick about you it's it only makes you greater because it's all lies energy don't lie you're a beautiful person inside out so when somebody is lying on you it's going to bounce right back to them like a rubber band and it's only going to bring you more blessings somebody really think that they're doing something but you're staying in you're living in your truth can't nobody stop that you're being authentic and genuinely you and you're a very caring person, okay? And that's why people want to be around you. And this person don't want people to be around you. This person wants people to see you as a bad person, but it's not working. Their agenda is not working. Purple drops could be significant. You could be using kaleidoscope drops or your hair is growing. Maybe you, you know how to make your own concoction to make your hair grow. People want to know how your hair grow fast or how your hair looks so nice. Even if it's not um, your real hair, this could be like, you know how to do hair or you always switching up your style. You have people guessing what your next style going to be like, oh, what they're going to do next. Like you get people that you got that wow factor. Like people are so invested in your life. And I feel like, um, you, you have an interest in life or it appears interesting or people are just very interested in you, okay? If this didn't happen yet, this is about to happen where people are tuned in on you. Like they're tuned in, they're watching you um, and see what's next for you, okay? Um, you're making a lot of things happen or you're just so unpredictable because you lived a life for you. And it's like a lot of people are, are inspired by that because they're like, wow, she or he do whatever they want, okay? They like, you could take pictures in nature. They like that. They like your aesthetics, your photos, and stuff like that. So you guys are about to, like, blow up. Like, you could be a vlogger. You're about to change the way you blog or the way you uh, pre present yourself on social media. You're going through some type of social media upgrade. Um, that's what I'm getting here. Something about the last drop. I have last drop draining you, cash cow. You may need to set boundaries or you set boundaries with somebody who is draining you, taking your money or always trying to use you. And this person don't like that because they can't use you anymore. Okay. And they're getting very frustrated. You could definitely be it. All that energy was put out of people. You putting it back into yourself. You're investing in yourself and they don't like that. Okay. Because they're so used to you giving them your last new tile floors could be significant or somebody does construction construction somebody name could be diamond or diamond hoop earrings could be significant somebody could be a loctician or you could be thinking about getting locks somebody name could be sue or somebody's getting sued okay or somebody is trying to copy you copyright infringement or somebody was trying to steal your style you know petty shit like that trying to steal your work 
okay? I'm also hearing you're the original. So if you're original, you could be an Aquarius, you're a showstopper, you're being guided to be original, to not conform, to go out there and live the life you desire and not the one that was forced on you, okay? Because somebody could be trying to force you. This could even be a parent, y'all, where there's like a parent trying to force you to take care of them, make you feel bad. Look at Tokyo. I think her name is Tokyo. Uh, Black China's mom. You know, somebody is in competition with their daughter um, because you're getting a lot of attention. So your mom could be saying bad stuff about you So because um, they're jealous because they want the attention you have received that you've been receiving. Okay. Somebody's in competition with their own daughter. Somebody even could be Roseanne or somebody has a racist mother or a prejudiced mother or a negative mother, a karmic mother. Okay, somebody is a gold getter. You're a gold getter. You get whatever you want. Your hustle is about to pay off. Okay, stay consistent, stay persistent. It's about to pay off. I feel like if you're thinking about changing up some type of aesthetic or something, it's going to pay off here. Um, yeah, because you're coming out of a trance. Okay, this could be some type of brainwash. This could be somebody who was um, manipulating you so that you can um, feel bad for doing things. For yourself okay this is somebody if you're not doing something for them they're going to make you feel bad for doing something for yourself okay um somebody about to pay off a note a car note or a house okay congratulations um the corner store something about a corner store somebody could be when um under the influence they take a lot of um bad habits if you know what i mean like a lot of and this person could be trying to cover up that they have a habit okay a bad habit um, I'm also hearing, you know, I'm bad at love. So somebody could be bad at love, or maybe you always thought, like, well, I'm bad at love. One, two, three, four, as I say that. And really, it's just that you didn't have the love. You didn't receive the love that you give. That was the problem. And now you're about to receive the love that in the support that you deserve, that you have been giving to others, okay? Um, you could be learning how to cut your hair or learn how to cut hair, cut your boy's hair. Because, uh, you know, the barbershop being expensive. Shit, I probably need to learn how to cut some hair. Um, shit, they be charging me an arm in the middle of the night. Anyway, <laughs> you could be um, about to be in a relationship. Y'all about to make a business because y'all both are hustlers to hustler mindsets. Even if this is not a relationship, this could be a friendship. And you guys, um, you're about to join with someone. It's going to be a successful business if you're partnering up with someone. Somebody could be a Libra. All right. You could be dying your hair red. I don't know what I'm getting. Or you're like in your um, your Scorpio energy and your your sex appeal energy. Yeah, page of swords. You have a lot of eyes on you, two of swords. Somebody is trying to block people from seeing you, from watching you. Somebody could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or a Taurus, okay? Or something about your Venus here. You're very beautiful. You get what you want with the Ace of Pentacles and the Six of Swords. Like I said, if you're not in this energy with the Six of Swords here, you're about to be flowing into this energy where you get whatever you want here due to your beauty, your brains, and your talents. If somebody is trying to, <laughs> they don't want you to have this pretty privilege, okay? That's what I'm getting. Three of Cups, Three of Wands. One, three three you self-mastered um something this could be uh you self-mastered success here you're receiving the support your tribe is coming in to support you and you're going to be making money off of your business there is a parent or somebody who is emotionally wounded by you who does not want this to happen for you they're not happy for you they're not happy you walked away from them that you found out that they were being slick to you Slick to talk behind your back, being negative to you. This person is either got caught or getting caught. Um, and while that's happening, you're a star in the making. You're a star. Like everybody notices you everywhere you go, even on social media. You have people subscribe to you. They got they hitting the bell button, or you know they're on your TikTok, um, they're on your Instagram. They're liking it. They what is she gonna post next? What is he gonna post next? Like it's really giving that energy. You're about to receive an increase. Can I get an in on be off? Thank you, spirit. Ooh, can I get an in on be off? Four of cups. Ignore the haters. Ignore the haters. Two of wands. Do your own thing. Yeah, because the spirit is saying <laughs> they too busy worry about you. They gonna end up broke while you receiving all your accolades. Yeah, the Nine of Swords, the Seven of Wands, 
And I said it in the nicest way possible because people are talking shit. You could be changing your nine to five or you're about to go um, get a new job here. Somebody is trying to block you because they know success is right around the corner for you. Um, some type of viral is up right around the corner. Yeah. <laughs> Love you guys.